Good morning, everyone. Jeanette Byro here. I'm a medium and a channeler. And if you're joining me for the first time, thank you so much. Uh, I'm excited to dive in with you for your message from spirit today. And today I am using the Isis Oracle deck. This is by Alana Fairchild. It's a beautiful deck. And as I always say in personal readings, um, I don't use cards. I go straight to spirit and just connect in through mediumship. But for these person or for these uh, general messages and weekday messages, I love using cards because it just gives a little visual for people to ponder with the messages that come through. So let's see what's in store for us through these cards for today and into the weekend. Let's see. Oh, wow, this is really cool. Okay, this makes a lot of sense. So I have been, um, I'll show you the cards first. So we have Flower of Life, which is just a beautiful, stunning card. We've got Life Restored here and Magic and Ritual. So the reason why I love this so much is in meditations for the last two days, I have been seeing this uh, symbol over and over and over and this symbol is a scarab the Egyptian scarab beetle and the scarab really represents life restored life coming back online life coming back on track and this because we're dealing with a general message this is a lot of positivity to me because this really means that there's a level within the collective now that is starting to come back on track which is what we were hoping for for October and so as it stands right now it looks like we really are heading in that direction so this is beautiful now that's generally, or that's for the collective, but for yourself, there is something within your path that is coming back on track, coming back into alignment. Life is being restored somehow, somewhere. And for you, it might be very obvious, or you might be thinking, well, totally not for me. If you're thinking that, I would take a moment to pause and ponder where is this happening? Even if it's just like a pilot light is lit in your life of being restored, Look into where that is and amplify that energy because this card, Flower of Life card, is all about manifestation. And what have we been talking about over and over again is manifestation. Spirit's strong messages right now are manifest. Use this time this month to manifest what you want in your life. This Flower of Life is all about like divine creativity. And if you know the symbol of the Flower of Life, it's how everything stems from a single point and multiplies and multiplies and multiplies all interconnecting and that really speaks to how we are connected to all things on every level so I would definitely look into what you can create where you're creating so that if you have already created something where your life is being restored you can see the fruitfulness of this or if you're not seeing it yet, recognize there's a pilot light lit somewhere and you can absolutely amplify that pilot light through this Flower of Life card. Now, I love this too because this third card, Magic and Ritual, says that when you create a sacred practice, whether it be meditation, exercise, dance, movement, prayer, creating an altar, saying mantras, whatever it is, but whatever you determine to be your sacred practice, that sacred practice will help increase the frequency and the potency of your manifestations. And so it's whatever you want it to be. Sacred practice really is whatever you want it to be. But as long as it is um, persistent, continual, repeated, do it over and over every day. Put that energy into motion and then amplify it by following it repeatedly. That's what this card is saying. So really, you guys, this is a beautiful pull for a Friday, uh, for October, for what we're moving through right now. This is a ton of positivity for you guys, for all of us moving forward. So make the most of it this weekend. Take the long weekend again. If you're in Canada, it's Thanksgiving. Take this long weekend and really look at your life. Look at what's working. Look at what's not. Clean up what isn't and really bring this life restored card in the middle here to the forefront and create from that energy. If something is working really well in your life, use that energy and pull that energy onto something that's maybe not and rearrange it. Choose differently to put it into alignment for you. So I hope that helps you guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful Friday and Thanksgiving if you're in Canada. 
Uh, if you're liking these videos, please do like and subscribe. And also for everything else, check out avalonspirit.com, uh, the Jeanette Byro podcast. And also, if you want to connect with me every day, there's the Avalon Spirit group on Facebook. It's a beautiful group. We've got lots of people on there sharing different things on consciousness and spirituality and all kinds of stuff. I'm on there every day, so do check that out as well. All right, have a good weekend, you guys.